Hello and welcome to Nikolai's Genetics Lessons and today we are going to talk about laboratory calculations and here is a simple problem. How would you make 1 liter of 5 molar solution of substance with a molecular weight of 75 grams per mole? First of all, let me remind you how we calculate mole of something. So here is a periodic table of elements. Now let's calculate how much 1 mole of CO2 gas would weight according to our table. Carbon has atomic number 6 which stands for the number of protons and this number here which is 12.011 is molar mass of this atom or which is 12 grams. And 1 mole of oxygen weights 15.999 so 16 grams we can round to 16 and that means that this molecule 1 mole of CO2 is going to weight 12 grams for the carbon and 16 grams for each oxygen. So 1 mole of carbon dioxide is going to be 44 grams. When we are talking about moles we are talking about a measure which is weight which we uh, count in grams. Now let's return back to our problem and let's solve it. So we are told that we have some substance which is 75 grams per 1 mole and we need to make 5 molar solution. That means that we have to multiply 75 by 5 and we are going to get 375 grams of our substance which is going to be 5 moles of this substance. And this was our first step and our second step would be to add this 375 grams in this beaker. So let's say it's going to take this much space. The substance can be a solid or it can be a liquid. And step number two is going to be we have to add solvent and we measure solvent in not in grams but in a volume of milliliters. So this is going to be milliliters here and 1 liter is 1000 milliliters. So 1 liter is 1000 milliliters and we have to bring the volume of the solution up to 1 liter. So if 1 liter is going to be here so up to here. And this is how we are going to get 1 liter of 5 molar solution. One more step here can be to stir solvent and solute in order to get homogeneous liquid. Then again check the volume and if needed you can also add solvent in order uh, for the line B exactly at 1 liter or 1000 milliliters. And this is all for today. Subscribe and see you in the next video. Goodbye.